LIDAR, which stands for Light Detection and Ranging, is a remote sensing method that uses light in the form of a pulsed laser to measure ranges to the Earth. These light pulses combine with other like, data like a cool science thing that you can explore. And I think that would be really cool. <laughs> Hello everybody, my name is Wisecream and welcome to LIDAR. Yexi. Uh, I hope I explain what LIDAR is in, in just a moment. But we need to use the left mouse button to scan. And scanning will let you uh, use lasers to see what's in your immediate area. Uh, use mouse scroll to change the scan radius. Okay. So if I scan, if I want to make it more broad, okay. Oh, that's interesting. Okay. Uh, you make it more broad, but it's less detail. Oh, wow. We're fast. Okay. And we use right mouse button for detailed scans. Ooh. Holy frig. Dude. So using this laser technology, we can map out our surroundings in the dark without the need for uh, the visible light spectrum. Wow, that's, that is fascinating. This is, this is real technology, I'm pretty sure. Wow. This is terrifying and also incredibly satisfying. Ooh. Ooh, that's, whoa! What is that? Wow. Hell. Okay. This is really, really cool. Oh, you can see in the past. What the frick? I guess these are points of data, so I guess if you did have a tool to, like, measure it correctly, then you wouldn't need to, like, actually, you know, be there to see it. That's pretty interesting. It's like a, it's like a point on a graph. Wow, okay. That is really creepy. Look, so we're in a room, and this room exists, right? But we can't see it because it's too dark. We don't have any light to reflect light on the visible light spectrum. We're using this technology. We can scan the room and then, oh. But the further you get, the the, 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 the signal is weaker, so you can't see forever. Wow, that sound. Oh, I guess that's how many points we made. This is really satisfying to watch. That is creepy. Whoa. Oh, can we scan multiple times? Yeah, okay. We get a really detailed scan in here. I guess if you do it enough, then... That is fascinating. What the hell is that? This is crazy. Let's, uh... Let's continue, then. What is this? What is this? What is that? Oh, it's a duck. Or a goose, or something. So, these, these 3D uh, objects. It's so, I think the laser, just, the laser just maps a point, right? It just maps... Oh, I'm sorry. So, I guess it just maps a point in space. And then, uh, maybe we're using some sort of headset in order to see it. The point in space. We can move. Okay, that's cool. That is fascinating. Really cool. I'm not sure if the technology exists in the same way like this, but wow, is this really neatly implemented. This is insane. Okay, so, seems that we have a hallway like this. What does that say? Is that a word? Zuck? Okay. <laughs> Seven, one, two, eight. All right, remember that, everybody. What the frick? I hope there's no jump scares or anything. That is so cool that we can like see in the past and stuff. I wonder how it doesn't get too plus uh, cluttered. Uh, uh, this, looks, this, looks like a corner. this is fascinating. This is I I think this is really cool. I hope you think this is as cool as I do. But uh this is really, really interesting. So 712 is our code. We need to find a place to input the code. Oh, Ooh, that's, yeah, that's, ooh. Green dots? Let's, I wanna, I wanna zoom in on that. Can we zoom in on that? 
Oh, that's, that is really interesting. Oh, that's so cool. I hope there's no, like, enemies, because then, like, that would be impossible to see him. Okay, so we can direct the lasers and then uh, get, a, get a better reading from a distance, so I don't have to go in anywhere. That's great. That says exit. <laughs> Dude, it's so accurate that we can start reading things. And there's a number pad there. That is so cool. That is so cool. I think this is so cool. And the fact that this is used for a, for a scary game is also really cool. But I think that you could use this for, like, uh, like puzzle games and stuff, too. But using this for a horror game is, is really, uh, you know, really good. Uh, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, eight. Wow. Yay, we did it. I have a feeling that we're gonna get jump scared right about now. Okay. Well, that's a star. Wow, that is really freaky. Let's do this a couple times just to get our bearings, just to get our bearings down. Go to a spread shot. Oh, this is really open area. What the? Let's see what's over here. Oh, that goes far. That goes far. Let's zoom in. I don't want to go in there. Oh, wait, hold on. Zoom in all the way. Be beacon. Still can't see it. Oh, all the way in the distance. Why does my footsteps sound like a heartbeat? That's really freaky. Can't walk with these up. Okay. That's fine. Let's uh let's zoom in on what's going on here first. Oh, I can yeah, this is a horror game. I always forget sometimes. Dude, this is so cool. Let's zoom in there. I'm, I don't want to go in there blind. You know? What you can't see will kill you, alright? Oh. Oh, that's freaky. Um really open area. Still indoors, it looks like. I really hope nothing comes out. Oh, dude, this is freaky, man. This is freaky, man. What is this? What is this stuff? Okay, what? Is this just like a. Are we in like some sort of valley? Are we still. No, maybe we're outside. This room is way too big. Oh, this is freaky, man. This is freaky. Scanning, just keep scanning. Just keep scanning, scanning, scanning. Just keep scanning, scanning, scanning. Just keep scanning, scanning. Just keep scanning. So, it definitely feels like we're outside now. Huh. This is sort of. Oh, maybe this is outside the building. This is a doorway or something? You know, honestly, if there wasn't like scary ambience, this would feel like this would feel like a science like simulation. That's what it'd feel like. Like that's that's genuinely how I feel right now. It would just be like like a cool science thing that you could explore. And I think that would be really cool. <laughs> ah! Ah! Oh! 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 That scared the hell out of me! That scared the hell out of me, man! Bro! Oh. 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 oh! oh! Holy frick! Oh my goodness! Well, he ain't here no more. Figure ain't here no more. Oh lord. Oh lord. Just keep scanning. Just keep scanning. 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 Green. That means good, right? Oh. That actually scared the hell out of me. That was a very well done scare. Frick you. Definitely feels like a forest. Trees and stuff. Oh 
my goodness. Oh my goodness. I'm scared, man. I'm scared. Like, I was talking about a science simulation, and then the hat man came out and scared the hell out of me. Oh. Um. I, I don't know what to expect now. I'm, I'm almost afraid of what I will uncover with this technology. Something hiding in the- ah, 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 What was that? What was that? What was that? What was that? This looks really cool. This looks like a science thing, man. Uh, 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 oh my god, I didn't even see anything. This looks really cool. This looks so cool. I hate this so much. Oh, oh, oh. Okay. Okay. Oh. Seems that we like we've mapped out a lot of this part. Uh, I think I think there's more over here. experienced in exploring tunnels. Let's see what this print looks like. It looks like the print of an animal. There's an animal in here. Let's see. Let's get a closer. Let's, uh, wow. So this is definitely a large beast of some kind. And if it's, if it's taking shelter in this tube here, then I'm not sure if it'd be the greatest idea to go ahead and, and explore said tube. However, uh, having explored tunnels before of similar fashions, I think it is necessary that I do so. It seems my laser cannot go too far in. But the, the, the prints continue, and they do not stop. Okay. Okay, you know what's so cool? It, like, prints an image, and then you move, and then the image moves. So I print this image, and it's like, huh, and then it just starts moving. That's fascinating. Okay, but, uh, we're gonna have to continue. Is that the end of the level? Okay, that's the end of the level. Lidar at EXE, that was a fascinating game. Oh, well done. That was really cool. That was really, really cool. And genuinely scared the hell out of me. That was a serious scare. Like, that was like, that was true fear that I just felt when that thing happened. Oh my goodness. It's just the, the limiting factor of what you know, because the root of all fear is the unknown, right? And so this, <laughs> this game completely leaves you in the dark. So scares like that, oh, that really worked. Uh, great implementation of this this uh, that thing. That must have been really hard to come up with. But wow, that was a really good experience. And I hope this will be continued somehow. Maybe not by the same developer. Maybe someone else. That'd be really cool. But boy, that was really cool. All right. Thank you, everybody, so much for watching. And I really, really hope you enjoyed that. It would mean a lot to me if you could actually subscribe. That would mean so much to me. But that's okay, because I'd hope to see you around. Bye-bye!